Yo, what's going on YouTube, man? It's your boy, Jake Glizzy, A64, man. We are back with another Modern Warfare 2 video, man. So, I got another special video for y'all, man. So, instead of doing, like, the best class setups, man, for the whole entire game, man, I'm doing the best class setups for rank play um, and rank play only. But, you can use these in um, core or just regular pubs. I mean, whatever you want to call it. You can use this in regular pubs as well because either way it go, these guns are going to be broken no matter what if you play on rank play or regular pub lobbies so it is what it is um i might be missing some guns just because some of the guns on here um on the game are actually like banned from the cdl and ring play so um if i'm missing some of your favorite guns i'm sorry like i know guns like the hemlock the m4 the uh, mx9 um uh, not the mx9 i think the stb um yeah those are like like pretty much banned from cdl and fucking rank play so i pretty much did not put like all the banned guns on here i just did like basically the most op guns on the game but you can use them in rank play as well that's basically what this video is going to be about so yeah that's going to be the video for today man if you are new to the channel man don't forget to subscribe get this video a thumbs up and stay tuned for these class setups for rank play because this shit about to be crazy all right y'all man so we're gonna go ahead and uh go over the first class setup man we're gonna be going over the veil 46 man so here goes some gameplay i'm using this in pub lobbies uh pretty much this gun is like really fast uh, especially with movement um you really ain't gotta worry about this gun being trash, bro. Cause no matter what you do to this gun, it's still gonna be broken as fuck. I mean, honestly, you don't even need attachments for this gun. But uh, yeah, as you see, this shit is broken as hell. But we finna go over the attachments, man. So for the barrel, I'm running the Tango 228 barrel. For the muzzle, I'm running the Spiral V3.5 flash hider. For the under barrel, I'm running the Edge 47 grip. For the magazine, I'm running that 30 round mag. And for the real grip, I'm running the Slagger Soldier Grip, man. So let me know in the comment section down below what you think about this class setup because it is pretty broken. And in rank play, this shit is like fucking godly as fuck. Um, this basically is like the class setup where you ain't really hurting this gun, but at the same time, it still stays overpowered because sometimes when you put certain attachments on these guns, it literally hurts the gun and you don't even know it. All right, so for the next class setup, man, I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all some clips for the TAC 56, man. This is the TAC 56 build that I was uh, that I usually use in rank play. Um, a lot of people use this build. This is like one of the this is like a pro player build basically. Um, so yeah, as you, as you can see, the TAC 56 broken as hell, like always. It's literally like pretty much top three best guns in the game mm. hands down everybody already know this shit um mm. but yeah so we're gonna go into the class oh, setup man shit. for the tag 56 oh. the best tag 56 rank play class setup here we go so for the barrel i'm running the tundra pro barrel for the muzzle i'm running the extend havoc 90 for the ammunition type running high velocity for the real grip running that demo clean shot grip and also for the stock i'm running the tv carnal stock so let me know in the comment section down below what you think about that tag 56 class setup or if you have a tag 56 class setup that's even better but this is pretty much built for long range um uh high damage um damage range uh that's what i meant high damage range but yeah so that's really it uh tag 56 class setup there you go so for the next class setup man uh as you can see this is the vez 9k this is like literally the class setup that i was using in rank play but uh, here goes some, yeah, some clips of me playing in pubs. This shit broken as hell, as always. Um, yeah, I really can't say nothing about the Vans Down 9K because it's literally like one of the best guns of the game. And everybody know this shit. This shit broken as hell regardless. But um, this build right here is pretty much for more like, just more damage range. Um, if you want to get in like, you know, far gun fights and shit and still win pretty much. Um, so we're gonna go over the class setup for the Vans Down 9K. So for the bear, I'm running the SA Responder 3. For the under bear, I'm running the FTAC Rubber 56. For the magazine, I'm running a 45 round mag. For the rear grip, I'm running the Demo X2 grip. And also for the stock, I'm running the Ultra Z stock. But yeah, I love this class setup, man. It's actually like pretty broken as hell. Um, up close and far range. Um, so yeah, let me know in the comment section down below what you think about this Vaznav 9K class setup for rank play. If you like it, if you don't, I mean, it really don't matter. I use it anyways. This is, this is like what's good for me. It might not be good for you, but just let me know in the comment section down below. All right, y'all. So for the next class setup, man, this is like a very underrated gun. A lot of people do not use this shit in rank play, but I think a lot of people should actually start giving the M13 B a chance because this shit has a very fast fire rate and it also kills really fast. And a lot of people think this gun is ass and it's really not. But, um, yeah, so as you can see, man, this is some gameplay of the M13B. This shit is broken as hell. If you put, if you use this shit in rank play, I, I promise broken. you, you are not gonna be disappointed. Like, just give this gun a chance, bro. I'm telling you. 
Oh, we finna go ahead and get into the M13 class setup, man. Here we go. Oh, for the muzzle, I'm running the FJX uh, Fulcrum Pro. For the ammunition type, I'm running that at 5.56 high velocity. For the rear grip, running that Bruin Flash Grip. For the magazine, I'm running that 45 round mag. And also for the optic, I'm running the Slimline Pro Optic. So yeah, that's the best M13 rank play class setup, man. Please give this gun a try because I know a lot of people are really like down taught this gun and it's actually really good. It's not trash, bro. Trust me. This gun is fucking broken as hell in pubs and rank play. Trust me. So another class setup, man, that a lot of people really sleep on is the MP5, man. I know y'all really like don't like locking this up just because it's, it's a very hard gun to use. But I'm telling you. The thing that y'all doing wrong is, bro, y'all really putting all these full, like, all these attachments on this gun. And what y'all don't know is all these attachments really hurting this gun. Like, you're putting attachments on the gun thinking that it's not gonna, it's gonna stop the, um, what do you call it? The fucking recoil and it's really not. Like, it's just gonna make your gun bounce. It's gonna be not, it's not gonna be accurate. Like, y'all really just fucking the gun up by putting these all the attachments on here. So you really just gotta put simple attachments on here and it's actually doing more good than it does damage to this gun and i'm telling you just listen to me use this class up and i promise you you gonna like think twice about like fucking not using this gun i'm telling you so we're gonna get into the class setup man for this gun but so for this for the muzzle i'm using a spiral v3 flash hider but on the bear i'm using a ffs shark fin 90 and also for the rear grip i'm using a lockman tcg you do not need all five attachments for this gun i'm telling you if you do that you're gonna be hurting this gun more than you think but yeah, so that's gonna be the class setup for the Lockman sub, man. This shit is broken as hell. I'm telling you, use this gun and rank play. Try it out, bro. It's not that bad. So yeah, we're finna get into the next class setup. So for the next class setup, man, this is a very slept on gun as well because everybody in rank play just uses the same motherfucking gun, bro. I'm tired of seeing the fucking bad nev in the fucking tank, bro. I'm telling you, that's all everybody using in this motherfucking game, bro. And that shit getting on my goddamn nerves, bro. I'm telling you. But yeah, y'all sleeping on the cast off five. Five, four, five, bro. I'm telling you, y'all are really fucking sleeping on this gun. So yeah, man, check this game play out, man. And this is why you need to stop fucking sleeping on this gun right here for the shit that you watch right now. But yeah, man, this shit broken as hell, bro. This gun is very underrated. It is really broken more than you think. If you build this shit the right way, I'm telling you, this gun is fucking OP as hell. It can compete with the Tag 56, bro. I'm telling you, this gun is broken as fuck. So yeah, we finna go ahead and get into that class setup, man. So for the muzzle, we're using the Komodo Heavy. For the underbear, I'm using the Edge 47 Grip. For the ammunition type, we're using that 545 High Velocity. And for the uh, gr uh, rear grip, we're using the True Tech Grip. And also for the stock, we're using the Pro Light TL3 Stock. So yeah, that's the best class setup for the cast off 545. It's broken in the pubs and in rank play. This gun is hands down slapper. Um, yeah, so cast off 762 got banned, so this is like pretty much all you had left. Just like the um, the AK 74 got banned, so yeah, this is really this is like one of the best guns in the ring play. Just stop sleeping on it, that's all you gotta do. Just fucking try this shit out. I'm telling you, this is literally like the most underrated fucking gun, like literally in rank play. I barely see motherfuckers use this class setup, bro. Y'all gotta stop sleeping on the P90, the PDSW528. Y'all have to stop sleeping on this gun, bro. Cause y'all literally do not understand how good this gun is. And yet, y'all just go to the Tech 56 and the bad there. Bro, if you literally take time to know how to use this gun, bro, I'm telling you, it's broken as hell. Look at the gameplay I'm showing y'all, bro. Like, look. Do you not understand that this gun is fucking broke? It's broken as fuck. This is literally. This is one of the brokenest guns in the fucking game, bro. Y'all just fail to realize this shit. But yeah, man. So we finna go ahead and get into that PDSW528, aka the P90 class setup, man. This shit broken as hell in rank play. So for the barrel, we're using that 9.5 Duke 30. For the muzzle, we're running that Spiral V3 Flash Hider. For the real grip, running that Bruin Q900 grip. And also for the comb, we're running that TV Tycomb. And for the stop, I'm running the hollow. It's in the stop. So yeah, this is the best rank play class setup for the PDSW man. This shit broken as hell. Telling you, stop sleeping on the gun. Just use the shit. Use it. I'm telling you, just use the fucking gun. You don't have to sleep on it. Y'all sleeping on all these guns, bro. Stop using attack in the van now, bro. This shit getting on my goddamn nerves. Use a new gun. I'm telling you, this shit is worth it. Y'all keep playing. It's worth it. 
but yeah so that's the end of the video man if y'all are new to the channel don't forget to subscribe man let me know in the comment section down below on what class setup that you like the most um if you are new to the channel man subscribe if you are new to this channel subscribe man make sure you click that like button uh make sure you go follow me on all my social medias man let me know in the comment section down below what y'all want to see next and i will catch you boys and girls in the next video